What's up, Nero Nation? Boruto Chapter 78. Oh my gosh. Kawak is on a whole other level. He's a bad boy. <laughs> you know, he's a bad boy. You know, there's no going back for him at this point, man. There is no going back. But yo, let's talk about that cover page with Naruto in the black and blue outfit. Dang, that junk clean. It's got to be one of my favorite cover pages, man. Probably in my top three. Let me know. Is it your favorite? Is it your top three? Is it your top five? I'm really curious to know how y'all uh, actually feel about this cover page because I think it's amazing. If I could get a poster of it, I would cop that in a heartbeat, man. I got to have it. Well, yo, mark my words. Yo, Shibe, he's around, man. The god of the clan is around, and I feel like he's laying dormant within Naruto's daughter. Just because Damien sensed that ability from her, you know, that uh, unknown power from her, that unknown strength, I feel like that was Shibe laying dormant, waiting for a moment to emerge, and it will happen at some point in the series. And it's going to be a big-ass twist that uh, Kishimoto is going to surprise us with. Mark my words, it's going to happen. Nero said it first. It's going to be a big surprise. Yo, Shibe is there. He returned, she returned, whatever she bay is. I don't know, you know, the sex uh of that person, of that, of that alien. But yo, they will make a return at some point. With that being said, let's get into the rest of the chapter, yo. You got them all going to Norto House saying, like, yo, we don't sense him, we don't know where he is, something's going on, as well as Hanata. And you got Ada not even hiding anything from no one's like, yo. Kawaki did it. He like, yo, no hesitation. Yeah, he did that shit. <laughs> yo, I thought it was hilarious, yo, that she just straight up said that, like, yo, this is the man you love, and you 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 switching sides on him? You switching sides already? Yo, she was like, yeah, yeah, he did it, man. For whatever reason, he probably trying to kill Boruto again. And like, yo, just spilled the beans to everybody again. And like, Sado was like, again? Yeah, 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 again. I don't know what else to tell you, Sado. It happened once before. And, yo, she looking at uh, Shigamaru like, yo, I thought Cole did it. Nah, I mean, you might well come clean. Nah, it, it won't. It won't cold. It was. It was kind of walking from the very start. So she takes off because Borto took off. And then that's when Shikamaru just pretty much says, like, yo, don't you go. You need to stay. Uh, Kawaki, he's, he's not in the right mind state. He might even attack you. But she still takes off anyway, which means that there's a chance that uh, Sadara could lose her her uh, title as a shinobi because she broke a she broke an order. That was a direct order, and she still ran off of Boruto. So it's a chance she may lose her um, headband and no longer be a shinobi. I mean, y'all let me know what y'all think about that. But you got Boruto heading towards uh, Kawaki or looking for him. Next thing you know, you got Kawaki actually trying to seal Boruto. He said he wanted to seal him, so I'm guessing he doesn't actually want to kill Boruto. He would have just sealed him away and let him just remain in that space you know, that space and time where that space where time doesn't exist for all of eternity. So, I mean, it does show that he still cares about Kawa. I mean, he still cares about Borto, but he cares about Norto even more. And the fact that he's just like, or then again, he could have just been saving him for last. Like, yo, he'll be the very last one I finished off. But we, we don't know. But Kawa, he's on some other stuff. Borto and him begin to engage in battle. It's like, yo, why are you doing this? Where's my mom and dad? And I'm very surprised because. Boruto, the last time, Boruto wanted to be killed by um, Kawaki, but now he had a change of heart. What made that change happen? Is it the fact that Momoshiki uh, said he could never fully return because of how he gave up the, was it, the 20% left of his karma to revive Boruto from death? Is that why uh, Boruto wants to live now? I'm really curious to know what what made him have a change of heart. And uh, hopefully we find out in the future. But while that's going on, you got Sadara who actually arrives to the battle. And Kawaki says the coldest line ever to her. Like, yo, he looks straight at her like, yo, I'm only going to say this once. If you want to live, don't butt in. <laughs> like, yo, I'm hearing that line like, dang, I, th I thought we was friends. We, we was just... uh drinking uh drinks the other day and playing card games like what's going on kawaki like i just thought it was hilarious that he said that like yo i'm only going to say it once don't jump in or you're going to die <laughs> it's just hilarious to see and i also love the fact that kawaki is using the abilities that shiki actually did with the cubes falling throwing the uh the little spears and stuff at uh borto even though borto is doing a great job avoiding them and actually actually defending himself quite well against kawaki which i'm really surprised I'm actually curious how far in power is Kawaki above Borto or Momoshiki, whichever one you want to say. Let me know y'all thoughts on that in the comment section below. But then you see um, Kawaki going to actually cut the head off of Sadra. But, you know, Borto jumps in the way and that's how his eye gets scarred up. Next thing you know, you got Miski wrapping his arms around uh, Kawaki's arm so he can't use his karma seal. And at the same time, you got Shikamaru doing his shadow clone jutsu. And honestly, the look the look on Miski's face like Miski had that look like yo bruh 
I don't know what you thinking, but you touch, you touch Boruto, yo. As soon as these people turn their head, I'm going to kill you. Because he said, yo, I don't care if I got to give my, give my life. You won't move. Like, this dude is willing to risk his life for Boruto. We already knew that, but he's willing to risk his life for it. Then they jump to Amado, and of course, you know, he's still looking sketchy as ever, acting all surprised. I don't understand why Kawaki would do this. There's got to be something else. There has to be a bigger meaning to all of this. And I'm like, yo, Amado, get your ass off the panel. Ne next thing you know, we went to another panel. He was no longer there. <laughs> he was no longer there. The next thing you know, you got uh, Sasuke popping up with the blade to the neck, and Sasuke was like, yo... Hey, look, man, stay still, son. I, I'm not going to hesitate to kill you. If anything, yo, I, I'm I'm itching for a reason to do it because you, you attacked my daughter. So, yo, make make sure you don't make a step, man. I'm looking at you, man. Shot and got locked on. Sadara, I don't know why you ain't pull yours out, but we'll talk about that later, baby. That, that's the look Sasuke had, and I can respect it because everyone's sitting, sitting here saying like, yo, why, why she ain't have her Sadara, uh, her shot and gun out facing against Kawaki? I mean, if anybody you face off against and the Leaf Village, Leaf Village needed you to have a shotgun gun activated. It would be going up against Kawaki. Why the hell do you not have it activated? Hey, that's a whole nother story. But you know, Sasuke had that look like, yeah, we gonna talk about this later. You know what I'm saying? If anything, you might get grounded after this shit. <laughs> you know, that's the look that uh, Sasuke had. But next thing you know, Momoshiki makes an appearance, and Momoshiki ends up absorbing the um, chakra from um, from the Shadow Possession Jutsu allowing kawaki to escape he tells him to run you won't be able to kill me if you get captured or if you die right here and now so he gives him the opportunity to escape and i'm really curious to know why momoshiki did that is it because he still plans on feeding kawaki to the tree or still using him as bait to like lure code out i'm really curious what's the reason momoshiki did that because he always he already said that he could never come back truly because he gave up the rest of his uh karma seal in order to revive borto so what is the plan i got to know if you guys have any ideas let me know in the comment section below and then that's when shikamaru goes as far as to say well he can't get too far he's been using that shrinking ability quite a bit he can't have but so much chakra once he reappears that's when we'll strike again then you got sadara apologizing to boruto and i'm like yo you wouldn't have to apologize if you had your sharding gun activated get the hell out of here that's what i'm thinking but boruto was just like yo it's all good man it was that super stupid idiot's fault referring to kawaki next thing you know they show momoshiki saying like yo you've already lost one blue eye you'll be soon you'll lose everything else as well and he starts fading away into the dust and now he was like yo this is the beginning of the end and i'm like yo you cannot end a chapter like this i need to know what else happens where I, why why yo boruto needs to be weekly or bi bi-weekly yo i promise you man i really need to know what happens next but hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and if y'all did make sure y'all thumb it up subscribe hit the bell for all notifications sorry to say my normal setup but i'm at work i do apologize hoping y'all have a great day and night wherever you are this your boy nero mega man signing out peace